All right, so huge, huge, huge parcel from Japan with Nintendo consoles. We have retro Nintendo consoles and I mean all kinds of Nintendo consoles from Japan. And wow, yeah, this is a huge parcel. So I mean, let's just get started. I shipped this with FedEx and the value of this uh, or of the things that are in here is about $2,500, something like that. And I have no clue what shipping is going to cost, but it's going to cost a lot. But I mean, I had the choice to either wait three months or get it, yeah, and pay less for shipping or get it in like four days and pay more. But I, I filled this thing up with a lot of consoles so it is definitely worth it as long as shipping doesn't cost more than like five hundred dollars then i'm happy oh my god you know what let's start with uh, this thing this i can already see is a new 2ds ll not xl but ll because it's japanese and it's region locked but oh wow yeah it looks so good Wow. Yeah, but it's uh, region locked and the condition is just awesome. I'm guessing I paid about $100 for this thing, so uh, not a lot. Power is on. Looking good. Yeah, there we have a 2DS. Just gonna put that aside. I'll just count that as a win. Wow, yeah, so we have some 3DSs too. There's actually a person that wants to buy a normal 3DS and I have none. I only have one new 3DS XL left. That's all I have for 3DSs and 2DSs. Everything else got sold. So here we have a 3DS. Boom. Power is on. The R button is a little stiff, but... Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it looks good. Probably no problems, but... Yeah, I'll have to figure that out later. Oh my god, I can see Game Boys. I can... Holy crap. This is filled up. Oh my god, this is... I think there's like 30... 30 or 40 consoles in here. Yeah. 30 or 40 consoles. So this is going to take a while. So here is another 3DS. Oh my... Boom, got that out, turn on, no screen protectors, but the screens look awesome. Yeah, I don't see any yellowing yet. I can just tell from the backlight. Yeah, yeah, it looks good. I'll just have to go through this a little faster because I mean, 30 to 40 consoles, that is a lot. I mean, I guess y'all can count. I'm not exactly sure how many consoles there are. Boom, here we have a DSi, oh, it's defective. Yikes, why the hell did I buy this thing? Hmm, yeah, I mean, the bottom needs to be replaced, but yeah, I mean, it's fine. I'll just give it a clean, maybe I'll replace the bottom. Or I'll just sell it cheaply as long as it works as it should. That's the most important part. And the screens, of course. So here we have another Nintendo DSi. Boom. Yeah, this one is in much better condition. Almost new, I would say. I mean, everything that's not almost new, I would say, is bad condition. So here we have a 3DS XL. Boom. Does that have a SD card? Yes, it does. And does it work? Yep, and it has scrimped a... Oh. Nope, it has some issues. I'm guessing the sound cable?
Hmm. I can't remember if I bought it with issues. So here we have another DSi. Hmm. I mean, I have seen worse condition. It's fine. Moving on. And in the end, I'll show you everything I've got. Wait, what is this? You know what? Oh, is this like a Pokemon? Yeah. It's like a Pokemon case or something like that. I have no clue what's in here. I'm guess yeah, okay, Nintendo 3DS XL. But is it the new or the old model? Oof, there's some corrosion on here. Can you see that? Oh, it's the uh, old model. And it's a limited edition. Let's look at the games. Tetris, but it's Japanese. Mario Kart, whatever that is. And Super Smash Bros. Yeah, uh, I mean, it's a limited edition, all right, but the condition is extremely bad. The hinge is also pretty bad. Oh, the 3D is defective. It says that it's on when it's off. Like now it's off and it's on. Oof. Yeah, it does have some issues. Two defective new 3DS XLs. Not a great start. Hopefully I bought them defective. Oof. Hopefully. I do not have any more DSIs, so to get them back in stock is good. Same with uh, the 3DS's. Hinge is a little weird. Yeah. Most likely good. I just buy them in bulk. Or I don't buy them in bulk. I just buy a lot of them when I buy them. <laughs> so, yeah. DS, no, DS Lite this time. Let's look at this one. I actually do have some DS, Li uh, DS Lights, yeah. So it does have screen protectors, which is good. R works. Does L work? Those are like the most important buttons. Yep, good. Good, good, good. That is trash because, I mean, I can't really use it. That is a charger. Trash, trash. This might look bad, but I can't really use those chargers. They're worthless, basically. I would have to use more money than they're worth to make them work here in uh, Norway. So, they're just trash. Boom, let's look at this. Normal 30S. Looks good. Does it work? Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Yes, it does. Why are there so many folders? Oh, creating data management on SD card. Yeah, okay. Looks good. Moving on, you know what? Oh, that's a DSi. Oh, yes. Actually, a person wanted to buy a DSi Excel, and I actually think they wanted a white one. So it's exactly what they wanted. I'll have to contact them. Yeah, I mean, it's region locked and all of that, but I mod, I, I'll mod it. And uh, she wanted a modded one, so perfect. Oof. I think it was a she. Boom. Now, DSi XL. Oh. Uh-oh. Okay, never mind. I thought the power button had some issues. Yeah, looking good. Or does it? Hmm. There might be some scratches on the bottom screen. Or I might just have to clean it. Not sure. We'll see. Boom, white. Oh, actually I found out that uh, the 3DS, new 3DS XL in white, it's it never was released in America. So to find one, in America is like really, really hard. And uh, let's see if this actually has IPS screens because the last white one I had had both IPS screens. So I guess we'll see. 
Nah, nah, it has a IPS bottom screen, but the top one is uh, not IPS. I mean, it's not a big deal, but uh, they're worth more because people think it's a big deal. So, um, yeah, I mean, it, the viewing angles are better. Don't get me wrong. And uh, if I would buy one, I'd prefer the IPS one. But, I mean, yeah, I mean, I would pay a little more for it just because it's actually better, but not much more. Like maybe $20 more if they're both IPS. But people pay like $100 more. I mean, I guess it depends on the person. If you really want the best of the best and have a lot of money, then why not, right? Why not? Boom, Game Boy Dance. Oh yeah, the screen needs to be replaced. I guess that's gonna be a video on how to replace the Game Boy Advance screen. Yeah, battery terminal did look good though. Here we have a new 3DS. No, not new. I mixed them up all the time. I might have already mixed up some things. I'm sorry. Yeah, so here we have uh, some re really much wear. Yeah, it needs to charge and the D-pad needs to be replaced. I'll just put that in the parts file. No fully working uh, 3DS Excels yet, which sucks, but uh, it is how it is. All right, let's see what we have here. Mm, good condition. New 3DS XL, or should I say LL because it says LL. But uh, yeah, needs to charge. Game Boy. First generation with a game. Oh, this needs to needs to be replaced. Battery terminal looks good. Game is trash. Oh, and the screen is trash. Yikes. That's too bad. Yeah. Yeah, I mean I actually do have some screens. Maybe I got it like in a bulk or something. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, what's this, DSi XL? Yes, DSi XL. And blue, actually a lot of people buy these blue slash black ones. Not really sure why. I would personally go for like a white one because I like the, uh, I just like the white one. But this one, I mean, I guess it looks good, but I don't know, I would prefer the white one. Yeah. Moving on. There's actually not that much in here anymore. Boom, screen works good, Game Boy Advance. The back sticker needs to be replaced, the battery terminal looks good. I think we're like 50% there, what? No way. No freaking way. No freaking way. Holy moly. Oh. It's a pearl Game Boy Advance SP. I have never owned one of these and I have owned like 50 Game Boy Advance SPs. Never a pearl one. And this is an immaculate immaculate condition just perfect just perfect every single thing about it just perfect i mean it does have a little or some scratches and it does have a uh, ags uh, 001 screen but i mean yeah oh yeah this one also looks good i like the color on this one like look at this <whistles> looks perfect the red one but not that many by the red one too and I don't really know why it's mostly the blue slash uh, black one all right let's see here what do we have here another DSi XL this one also people buy a lot of and it often has scratches on the bottom screen like it does here I'll probably just replace the bottom screen touch here we have a You'll never guess. You will never guess. You will never guess. Uh, 
a Nintendo new 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 come on new 3ds XL and actually yep this one is already sold because the condition uh, someone already paid me uh, like three hundred and twenty dollars to get one in really really good condition and guess what this is it really good condition it just needs to be modded and region changed and they'll probably pick it up like tomorrow so yeah great three new 3ds xl so far which is fine and here we have some 3ds's 3ds's i think i now sell them for 100 and 70 or 80 dollars Ooh, this is a red one really pretty so yeah they're starting to get expensive i personally would like if i would be any of you i would personally just buy one as fast as humanly possible because the value of those just goes up and up and up and up and up and up and up oh that needs to be cleaned up oh. yeah i would clean that i will clean that boom Another one, pretty, pretty Game Boy. Ooh, yeah, condition is, yeah. Wow, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Mm. Yeah, this one can go for even more, I think, than 170. We'll see. We'll see how the sales go. We'll see how fast I get them sold. Because if I get them sold like really fast, then I might take up the value because of the condition. Like I do, I do that sometimes with new 3DS XLs. Like if they come in really, really good condition, like almost new condition, I'll sell them for like $20 more. Like not much more, but just like if the customer wants the best of the best, then you know i can sell it for the to them but it's only if they like ask like oh could you please give me the best of the best like least scratches all of that then i'll say yeah sure but it costs a little more because i mean i can't like why miss out on free money basically or i mean i do actually pay a little more for the good condition ones but not 20 dollars more like Maybe like $5 more, but I mean, I run a business at the end of the day. I don't do this for, or I mean, uh, I mean, I guess I just do this for money mostly because I have to survive. This is like, this is how I survive. Like I have moved out now and I survive off this. So it's mostly money now and uh, I'm soon going to buy a car. So that's fun. Boom. This one is reset. Content YouTube money. I guess that's what I do with this at the end of the day. It used to be like more fun, but now it's more work. It's more just work, 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 work. Fix console, fix console. It might, might sound fun, but trust me. Like if, if any of you do this, like the same thing as me, just like in another country or whatever, then you'll you'll understand what I mean after time. Like at the start, it's really fun, like electronics, taking it apart, like at least for me, I have always loved taking like things apart and fixing them or whatever and putting them back together. But now I have to, like after like three years of doing the same thing every single day, it gets boring. Oh, yeah, the screen on this. Yikes, yeah. That's too bad. I guess that's just like parts or whatever. Won't be able to sell that. To say it like that. Does it have a screen protector? Yes, it does. Yeah. So, DS light. Now, there's not much left. Oh my God. What do we have here? Wow, this is a new 2DS XL in box. Look at this. 
No charger though. Wow. Boom. Come on. Boom. 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 And let's see the condition it's in. If I remember correctly, it's in really bad condition. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, it's it's not bad. I mean, I it could be worse. Oh, screen look screens look fine. Yeah, no, it's fine. What? Okay, there might be a touch problem. But uh, yeah, I mean, the bottom does have a little scratches. Does it have an SD card? No, it does not. Yeah. I mean, um, all right, all right. Could be worse, could be worse. Okay. How many, do we have, how many DS, DSi XLs do we have? Is this a DSi XL? No. So this is the last DSi XL, no, 3DS XL, sorry. And, um, if it's defective, I'm going to lose my shit. I'm going to lose my shit because I can't, I need these. I need these to be working. And I need them now, not after I have fixed them because that takes time. And I just got back from vacation and I don't have time. That's the last thing I really have, time. I have so much work, so many consoles to fix, so many consoles to send. And I even have another parcel. This parcel weighed 15 kilograms and the other one weighs eight. So uh, yeah. Okay, condition wise, it looks good. Oh, okay, it needs to charge. Hopefully it works though. So what do we have here? Can't see what's in here. Yeah, I, I usually like to save the bubble wrap, but I have so much at the moment that I don't really care. What the hell is this? Oh, it's a DSi. Wait, can you see this? Yes, you can. With a case. I for a second thought it was a new 3DS. Oh, okay, no spoilers, but uh, the other parcel is gonna be good. Come on, let's get this shell off. Come on, buddy. Let's get the shell off. Oh. I recently Ben tested a DSi XL. Yes, that was me. And uh, they're actually in really good con like they're really durable. I thought they were they would break really easily, but they don't. What game do we have here? Trash. Yeah. Condition pretty bad. Or I mean middle, middle, something like that. Another DSi XL. Let's see here. That's the wrong pen. That's a 3DS pen. Let's see, does any of the 3DSs miss a pen? Yes, this one. I'll just put a pen in here. Boom. Good. Now, let's test if this thing works. Yep, looks good. I have really many DSIs now, which is good because people do buy them. Many 3DSs, many DSIs, many new 3DS XLs, which is good because those are the... Oh, because I earned the most money on those. The new 3DS XLs, and recently people have been buying those up. Boom, another one. Good. Another DSi XL. Oh, yes, 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 yes. I sold all of mine because I didn't have any more 3DS chargers. So I had to get rid of mine. But finally, I have my own again. It's really good because like if I have to test a 3DS, I don't have to take a new charger. I can just use that. Oh my God. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Look at this. Condition. New. New condition. New, okay? I'll say it. New. New. And I turn it on. And the yellowing. Oh my god. <sighs> Just 
just disappointment. Disappointment on all levels. On the 3DS, you can actually remove yellowing, I think. You can, like, if you mod it, you can, like, oh, yeah, top screen is defective. Put that in the 3DS, X, new 3DS, no, the 3DS XL pile, yeah, because defective. Oof. All right, and here we have a Game Boy First Generation, and looks good. So, let's just go over everything. Four first generation Game Boys. Two, wait, yeah, this is it, right? Yep, two Game Boy Advances. One defective DSi. Uh, four defective or need to charge 3DS XLs. One defective DSi. Uh, one inbox new 3D, no, new two DS XL. Three new 3DS XLs. Oh my god. My back, oops, my back is killing me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven DSi XLs. Boom. Two DS Lite. Another new two DS XL. One, two, three, four, five, six DSi's. And. One, two, three, four, five 3DS's. Normal 3DS's. So count how many that was. That was many. Oh, and the Game Boy Advance uh, SP and Pearl. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Immaculate. Immaculate. So yeah, that's going to be it. I'll, uh, here you can watch the video on how to, or <laughs> how to, on uh, the other parcel that I also have. It's right there. I can't really turn the camera too much because I'm using a weird, uh, stand thingy but yeah eight kilograms also big parcel a lot of consoles a lot of consoles so yeah i'll link that right here and uh, thank you for watching like dislike subscribe and i'll see you in my next one peace out <laughs>